Hello and welcome to EVA 2023. We are here at the Vector Optics booth and in this video we are not going to present any new products but we are going to present a new technology that Vector Optics is going to incorporate into their different line of products. And this is, they finally made a fiber optical illumination. Yeah. So like a fire dot inside the reticle. Yeah, so meaning that, as you know, in recent years, there were not a lot of rifle scopes and very low budgeted, uh, low budgeted price ranges that would have this feature. Yeah. We just spoke like 10 years ago, yeah. it was like, we have seen the Japanese, like Vixen, one to yeah. six or something like that. They were the first affordable scopes with this technology. True. Uh, and they were around 1000 euros, something like that. Yeah. So basically now in 2023, we see a trend dropping in terms of price, yeah. but including the fiber optical illumination. Yeah, we saw first with Delta Optical, they went down to, let's say, 750, 700 euros with this technology. Then we saw Burris, which did this. Vortex Optics with a, 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 with a PST. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Vipers PST series did it. And now, Vector is even pushing the envelope even lower because we are talking here about the scopes which will have a price range of all, already 400 euros. The Constantine model is below 400 euros, one to six model, it has a fiber optic illumination of the reticle. Yeah, we also have the Canon Enel, one to six by 24, and the same goes for this one. It has a fiber optical uh, illumination that offers daytime illuminated, which is yeah. really very nice. Really small lot and really, really bright one. And what is also very interesting is that Vector, they won't charge much more money because of this technology. Now, we know that uh, the Continental 1 to 6, which is optically really good already, with the previous technology for the reticle illumination, which was not really daytime bright, it was just on the on the edge of being and not being daytime bright. It costs around 450 euros, and they say that this addition will be less than 100 euros. Yeah. So we are talking roughly 500, 550 euros of price, and this is going to be a really good package. So so far we can see this happening in the Continental 1 to 6 and the Constantine 1 to 6, but we can surely expect more. Yeah, yeah, they will also go to other models, I'm sure, and I. I think this was the last thing for them that they needed to be compared with others as, as, as benchmark below 1000 euros. Because optically speaking and with turrets, the Continental line is really good for its value, for its price. We could say that the one thing they were missing was actually this technology. Because yeah, we yeah. especially like very wide field of view, very decent optical quality and now this, it yeah. really makes a no-brainer. Yeah, because when, when we did a lot of comparisons with Vortex, Athlon, Arc and with all of other scopes, they have really good turrets, they have really good glass and so on, they're only lacking the proper reticle illumination. Now they have this technology, I think that now they will be even more competitive, so... Yeah, yeah I think with this move, the competitors are really gonna have a very hard time. Yeah and they're always driving the price down. So this is always good for the customers who are searching for some entry-level optics, but still wish to have a decent quality. Thank you for watching this video. We hope you enjoyed it and we'll see you in the next one.